This course is designed to help you master a foundation in lighting, to teach you how to create incredible images, how to shape and modify the quality of light to achieve any stylistic vision at any time and in any place. This means we will be teaching you in real world settings, but we are of course SLR Lounge, so we wanna do things a little bit different. Damn, that looks good, dude. Great lighting with the light coming from the back like that. Yeah. So we're going to instruct you with equipment that you most likely already own because every image that you've seen here, every off-camera lighting and stylistic effect that has gone into creating all of the images in this workshop has been achieved with just a single on-camera hot shoe flash. So I'm proud to present the ultimate foundational course in lighting, Lighting 101 on-camera light shaping by SLR Lounge. So what are we gonna cover in this course? Well, in Lighting 101, like all of our products. We're gonna be taking you on an awesome photographic journey, lighting and shooting edgy punk rock styled fashion and editorial images here in the studio. But you know, to be honest, most of our time is gonna be spent on location outside of the studio. Places like in Lamis. Lamis is a desert in Southern California where we're gonna do an awesome conceptual fashion shoot. We're gonna head into downtown Los Angeles where we show you lighting techniques for a couple's engagement and portrait session at night. And since one of our, well, both of the couples are actually actors, we're gonna show you awesome techniques for cinematic headshots as well. From there, we're off to the beautiful rocky beaches of Laguna Beach to demonstrate lighting techniques for a bikini fashion shoot. And of course, right next to Laguna Beach, we have Orange County's trademark grassy hills and trees, and they make for the perfect backdrop for a bohemian-inspired fashion portrait session. And along with that, we're actually gonna do a family portrait session as well. We're gonna show you awesome indoor lighting setups for shooting portraiture of, say, handsome men, headshots, as well as awesomely cute puppies. We have to throw in some puppies in there somewhere. We're even gonna be going into the gym and we're gonna show you how you can use your on-camera hot shoe flash to modify and create fantastic fitness imagery. Now, at this point, I know what you're all thinking. Why are we teaching Lighting 101 with just on-camera flash? By using just an on-camera hot shoe flash, we can limit the amount of gear required and the gear that we need to learn about. We can focus in on understanding the principles of light, its quality, its color, how it can impact and dramatically improve your imagery. In addition, we can show you just how powerful your on-camera flash is as we create incredible images simply by light shaping. So we start the course by breaking down all the myths and stigma that kind of are carried with flash. Many people believe that flash can't look natural, when in reality, natural versus dramatic looking imagery is simply created by the flash to ambient light balance. And so we're gonna spend quite a bit of time there discussing how to expose and control ambient versus flash lighting. We talk about the myth that flash is overly complicated and overly expensive, it requires tons of gear. And to be honest, this myth is really completely dashed by the entire course itself because through the entire course, we're showing you how to create amazing images with simply our on-camera hot shoe flash, and we're using it in conjunction with inexpensive reflectors. We're using scrims and grids and DIY V-flats to create and shape the light for our images to create the desired look. For all of you portrait photographers, we spend a good amount of time discussing the five key and secondary light patterns, how the three primary subject positions relate to those patterns, and basically we wanna do this because we want you portrait photographers to understand each type of light and its related stylistic effect over your subject and over the final image. We also want you to understand and master the qualities of light, whether a light is soft or whether it's hard, whether it's diffused or specular, and more importantly, to understand that each of these qualities of light, well, they have a specific purpose. Soft, diffused light is kind of ideal for, say, family and couples and beautiful, flattering portraiture, while a harder and more specular light is often ideal for, say, fitness, fashion, or more editorial portraiture. Every light quality, key light pattern, secondary light pattern, all of these have a specific purpose and use. From there, we also dive into commonly heard but misunderstood concepts like the inverse square law. And to be honest, really it's practical application over lighting single subject and multi-subject images. On the more technical side, 
we show you how you can gel and use in-camera white balance for not only corrective purposes in matching the existing light in a scene, but also how you can use it for creative or stylistic purposes in creating special effects. We dive into full feature versus manual flashes, flash power and zoom, TTL versus manual control, recycle times, flash duration, HSS or high speed sync versus ND filters, first curtain sync versus rear curtain sync, our favorite flashes, flash modifiers, and basically every other gear related technical topic that you need to know. But best of all, every bit of the techniques and knowledge that we teach you throughout this course is designed to be your foundation and to be built upon. So welcome to Lighting 101, on-camera light shaping, another gold standard educational product and the ultimate foundational course in professional lighting techniques by SLR Lounge. You can learn more or purchase this course in the SLR Lounge store by following this link or clicking in the description below. My name is Pai and I'll see you all in the next video.